What's up guys, Spin Firearms here, of course, with my Glock 26. Some hate it, some love it, but it's my channel, so it is what it is. Today we're going to be reviewing an X-Grip. Now, I have them for my Glock 26, my Glock 27, my Glock 33, my Glock 29, and my Glock 39, um, and I believe that's all. But anyways, basically what it does is it takes your larger Glock OEM mags, because we all know that larger OEM mags work in smaller Glocks if you get the right mags and the right setup and so on, and it still runs reliably. This is a product that does not affect reliability at all. It sits perfectly on your firearm, and I've even changed out the base plates um, to other base plates and used the X-Grip, and it still runs fine. Now, a lot of people complain when they add a new base plate to their Glock that it pinches. Their finger sits in the wrong spot, and so when they're shooting, it pinches, and I get that because it's got to suck up that next round, and so it's going to get a little tighter and your finger is going to pinch if it's in the wrong spot. With the X grip, honestly, I've never had a single issue with pinching. Normally it's with pierce grips and stuff like that. But with these X grips, they actually are very ergonomic, very comfortable in the hand. And honestly, I do think they improve your shooting a little bit. Now, does your pinky really matter if it's sitting on the mag or this little grip sleeve right here? No, not really. Does it even matter if your pinky is hanging off the firearm? No, not really at all. But with something like this, a lot of people feel more comfort and security in having that full grip, basically making this Glock 26 right here into a Glock 26X. A lot of people that I talk to, they say, I wish Glock would have just made the 26X, and I agree, that would have been a big seller. I hope they still do it because I would be the first in line to buy one um, because I'd absolutely love the setup right here. Now, do I carry like this in the summer? No, I do not. In the summer, I'm going to be wearing tank tops t-shirts and gym shorts and i'm not trying to conceal something this big i have a hard enough time concealing a glock 43x which is going to be the same length as this right here um, and it's going to be a little wider so what i do is i carry with a smaller base plate but in the winter and the colder months when i'm going to be wearing hoodies stuff like that i'll conceal this 15 round mag with the x grip now there's other base plates base plates out there that do save you space compared to using the glock 19 mag the SLR Rifle Works base plate is one of those. You can go check out my videos on the SLR Rifle Works base plates. They're awesome, but this is a great option. It's cheap. I get base plates can be expensive, especially the one I just mentioned. It's like $55. So you can find these all over online. The other thing is I like these better than the 3D printed grip sleeves I've gotten in the past. Now, even though some of them are comfortable and they do match the texturing of your Glock, this just feels better. And what I do on my other one that I have for my Glock 26, I put a little bit of grip tape right here, a little bit of handle at edge series grips, um, just in the right spots on my firearm, which is down here. It gives it that little bit of extra grip, making it not as slippery, giving you, once again, more peace of, peace of mind. I feel like that's what the X grip is. It's peace of mind to people who want to have a full grip on a Glock 26. I like the X grip. I think it is a great addition to a firearm like a Glock 26. Um, I don't know if they make them for any other companies but Glocks, but if they do, you can look that up, I'm sure. But yeah, I enjoy the X-Grip. I have a bunch of them. Really like them. Thanks for watching.